Wednesday, March 1st. Happy Women's History Month. I'm currently on my way to the Billboard Women in Music Awards. Um, so really looking forward to that. I did a makeshift outfit change in the car. Um, and I still need to do a hair and makeup touch up when I get there, which I will also do in the car. It's being held at the YouTube theater, which I really like as a venue. That's where I saw Lil Nas X. I happened to spot that tickets were on sale on Ticketmaster and it felt really random. And I think I bought the tickets like a week and a half ago and I'm like, why not? So SZA is receiving the award for the, of the night, the big one. Um, but Becky G will also be there. Twice will be there and performing. I think Dochi will be there and performing. Rosalia and a bunch of other like like women in music who are like really killing it these days. I'm wearing Lorve shades. L O R V A E. Cop you a pair or two or three. And then I'm wearing this dress from Pretty Little Thing. Very low cut in the front. I wore this dress to our anniversary dinner on the cruise last week and I figured it'll also be like a really nice dress to wear for an award show. I also have this dress in like a rust orange kind of color. So I'm wearing black, wearing the same, basically wearing the same outfit I wore for our anniversary dinner. Down to the shoes, the shoes are from Target. But yes, I'm really looking forward to tonight's event and hopefully I remember to continue vlogging. Hopefully I'm allowed to vlog in there. I don't see why not. See you when I get to parking lot zone orange. It's cold, but I'm here walking in. to Dochi's mom, Celestia Moore. <laughs> Today I want to talk about a young lady who has exhibited nothing but determination and hard work throughout her life. She always had a vision and always believed that there was greatness on the inside of her. When my daughter decided to pursue music, she knew this is what she was called to do. After releasing debuts Persuasive and Crazy, she has proven she's a star and she has what it takes to rise. Let's take a look. She wants to congratulate SZA on being named Billboard Woman in Music of the Year. Let's take a look. Hey, glory child. Hey. SZA, we love you. We have always loved you. Ring the bell. SOS. 
is about to be 10 weeks at number one. You know why? Because you are the real deal. We need you. We're so honored to have you here and that you are willing to share your stories and your feelings with us. It has been an honor to know you as well as just know your music. You are so loved, you are so necessary, and you are so deserving of this honor of Woman of the Year from Billboard. Yeah, 2023 is your year. 2024 is your year. 2025 is your year. 2026 is your year. Every year is Solana's year. <laughs> and I'm declaring it right now. Hello, it is I think like 8 10 p.m. on Friday, March 3rd. Just got back from the store, did a little bit of shopping to start getting this new bedroom together. Um, didn't mention it, we're moving into a new room. Um, and so I want to do some cleaning. Bought a rug, but I had to leave it in the car because I couldn't find a good parking spot. But I wanted to sweep and mop anyway first and dust. So I think I want to start doing all that right now. But first I can do a little haul of the things I bought. I went to a few different stores, mostly looking for, whoop, mostly looking for discount stuff. Um, specifically went out for a mop and rug. And so I ended up going to Goodwill first, didn't find really anything there. And then I went to Ross and I got a mop for $7.99 and also from Ross I got other things that I didn't need I got this ceramic soup bowl that is good for both the microwave and the oven I really wanted something like this because I made a dip for a snack the other day and all of our pots and pans and oven safe things were just like way too big for the portion I wanted to make so this is a little speckle print and this was $4.99. They definitely had some other ones that were $2.99, but I like the way this looked the best. And I couldn't pass up this ceramic planter. It does have a drainage hole at the bottom and it also has a catcher attached as well as some like foam feet so it doesn't scratch anything. And I also got some Febreze plug-in refills and I will use this for the room and I am, at the stage in my adult life where I'm preferring just the normal clean scents for plugins and cleaning products versus Hawaiian Aloha Mango Breeze. So this is Linen and Sky. Probably gonna plug that in first so that room can start smelling normal. I need to also clean the blinds, clean the windowsill, and I would like to mop, but that's not like super high in the priority list. Also from Big Lots, I also got a 
thing of liquid detergent which i don't we don't buy we buy pods we have lots of laundry to do and if we're going to be moving over to a new room i want to try to get all of our clothes clean and all of our towels and sheets just really fresh and this will be specifically for cleaning all the clothes that we wore on vacation all the things that haven't been washed in a while and that is it Good morning, it's the next day. I just arrived at Ikea. It's, they've only been open for like 20 minutes. Here to look in their as is section to hopefully find some of those small furniture pieces that I'm looking for. Today is a full errand shopping day, which I love shopping. Hate when the money leaves the bank account. So heading into Ikea now. Hopefully I don't get distracted. I kind of want to plant too, but we'll see. I also forgot my tripod. See, I'm already distracted by the stoneware baking dishes because that's something I was looking for yesterday. And they have a good size. This is this actually. This is down here. I want this this from 12 to Mirrors. Next stop is Goodwill because I would like secondhand stuff for this stuff. And I've never been to this one before. I went to the wrong entrance. They said it's in the back, which is where I parked. So I found some stuff at Goodwill, definitely not the furniture I was looking for. I ended up buying a pair of jeans, which I'm like 97% sure that it's the same pair of jeans that I already own from Old Navy, but I've ripped the inner thigh as per usual. So I basically just repurchased a pair for like a super discounted price. But now I'm gonna actually head to Home Goods because I feel like that would be my best chance at finding those little furniture pieces I'm looking for. Fingers crossed, really hoping. The weather has turned a gloomy. The sky was very blue, but now it's very gray and cloudy. Might rain again. We've been having like a ton of rain in LA lately. So hopefully I can get in, find what I need. If I need to go to another store, do that find some lunch and get back home i really don't want it to rain at all because i need to do laundry that reminds me i need to go to target tesla drivers are so bold i tell you yeah. Yeah. 